We had family members who would come up to us and say, you know, I think I have a family member in this building, on this floor. Okay. They just need a way to look inside of those buildings. Cross clear, clear. You know, staircases leading up might be collapsed, or a few stories might be collapsed, or there might be rubble that is obstructing entrances. And that's exactly what happened here after Turkey's devastating earthquake. It looked like a nuclear bomb went off. A search for survivors, spearheaded by a team of Seattleites. Their, their families camped out, you know, outside of these buildings that they used to live in, where, you know, they're waiting for first responders to recover, like, the remains of their loved ones, for example. It's this man's invention, the lemur drone, that features a unique glass-breaking capability, has two-way communication, and sends signals via laser-based LiDAR technology, which in this case informed Turkish locals of their loved ones' locations, no matter the outcome. There was a, a significant amount of silent pride that we had that we were able to bring these families closures. After bringing as much closure as they could. I had a version of this that I, I personally thought was really good. The Brink Drones team returned to their headquarters in Seattle's Fremont neighborhood. Like I said, we work with around 400 public safety agencies uh, today uh, around the world. Where the innovator you see here is shattering more than glass windows. He's shattering the mold of what you might expect the CEO of an $80 million startup to look like. I'm 23. Blake and I went to dinner and he got carded. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Is this real? And though he may be young, local first responders are paying attention as he introduces his newest product, the oh, Lemur yeah. 2. I'm going to be switching to night vision. I'm in the hallway. Is it good if I enter? As it's flying around, clearing a building, or even on the exterior of a building, it's mapping it in 3D, which can help first responders tremendously. Informing the design of the Lemur 2, lessons learned in previous missions, like in Ukraine last year, where Brink helped Ukrainian first responders fight against Russian forces, and in Surfside, Florida the year prior, assisting in that deadly condo collapse. But Resnick's hopeful the Lemur 2 will help even more. There's just a huge amount of opportunity for these things to... I'm Maddie White. ...fundamentally help people. I've got contact. King 5 News.